you're welcome. It is fantastic to have you here. Football players don't have a shortage of football players. FIFA doesn't have a shortage of football players. And, you know, the fashion world doesn't have a shortage of mounts. There is a shortage of engineers. And that's not funny, that's kind of scary. Before you can build something, you have to imagine it. I mean, that's why I'm also a science fiction writer. It really is this notion that if you can, if you can imagine it, you can build it. But more importantly, if you can change the story that people tell themselves about the future that they will live in, if you can tell them new stories, get them to imagine a very different future, dream a different dream, then you can go build it. A robot is never going to have a heart. It's never going to love. So we're going to be taught to be better humans because of that. What if we had robots that were social? That's what they were supposed to do. And they were funny, and they were fallible, and they kind of fell down, and all that type of stuff. And because that, those flaws make them interesting. I think one simple thing to do as an engineer and as a designer is always remember it's about people. So how do we inspire kids in all corners of the world to want to become scientists, technicians, engineers? It's the coolest thing in the world. But it's the world's best kept secret. When you apply yourself, discipline yourself, you're welcome. So you have to go out there with that perspective. Solving problem, that's some superhero stuff right there. And if you want to do that, then do that. And if the stigma's there, who cares? You've got to have that attitude because the world needs you to have that attitude. Can we just give them a big round of applause and thank them?